Today on Blog Success Journal, we're talking about how to get advertisers for your blog. You know, we're talking about how do you find advertisers, should you go with individuals or ad networks, and just generally, how do you get started with advertising and monetizing? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, on to advertising. On to advertising. Here's the thing, before you even think about advertising on your blog, you need to make sure that your numbers support your cause. Okay, if you're getting 10 visitors a day, you're probably not gonna attract very many advertisers. But, I mean, the easiest thing you can do, okay, we like to say at least 10,000 visitors a month, but if you wanna get into the ad networks and stuff, it's gotta be a little bit higher than that, maybe up to 100,000. Yeah, absolutely. So how do you get people to advertise with you? You know what, tell them. Put a link on your site, you know, a little link that says advertise with us. You know how we've talked about this before, a sliver, a percentage of all the visitors to your site are going to be people looking to advertise to that niche, right? So put out good stuff, keep going your site, and have an advertise button or an advertise link, real prominent. So when this guy's reading your site, and, oh, advertise, huh, maybe I'll do that. Uh, you can also put up a blog post about, you know, all these special spots or deals you're offering for advertising. You can send an email to your email list. Just let people know, make it easy and obvious. Yeah, and go to the popular, other popular bloggers in your niche, okay? Normally, in any topic area, there's gonna be four or five major players, okay? Go talk to them. Come up with a little proposal. Tell them why they should advertise with you, what they're gonna get and why. You know, why should they do it? With yeah. you. Yeah, absolutely. And not absolutely. Joe. Yeah, they advertise with this guy, they'll, they'll probably be willing to try advertising some with you too. So, you can seek them out that way. Another thing is you don't have to get individual advertisers yet. They will come. As you grow and as your quality grows, yeah. they will come to you. That's just been our experience. The more you grow, the more they come to you, which is awesome. But you can join an ad network. You know, for example, Google AdWords is probably one of the simplest ones to get into and they just, you know, they're going to start showing ads on your site. You sign up, they'll start showing ads on your site, you get paid by the click. So you have to play with getting click throughs and whatever on that. But again, you can't just start your site and okay, my page says hello world and go sign up for AdWords and ad networks. Nobody's gonna go for that. You gotta have like Jennifer was saying, probably five, 10,000 visitors a month. And some of the bigger ones like blog ads or something, you've gotta have like 100,000. Yeah, yeah a lot of them yeah. want at least 100,000 visitors or possibly page views. But anyway, there, there are a lot of uh, ad networks and such, but I can't say it's enough. Focus on growing your site mm -hmm. first. Don't try to monetize from day one because you're, you're gonna be disappointed with the results. Okay, now, here's the thing. Ad networks are easy, individuals are profitable. Okay, you're gonna make a whole lot more money from individual advertisers just because they don't slice it and dice it so many ways. You know, yeah. if you're advertising with Google, you get a fraction of what they actually make. And it's really profitable if you combine that ad deal with an affiliate yes, thing. Yes, that's so something we you're do You're actually advertising and promoting their product on the back end with an affiliate kickback. So it's really a win-win for both of you. And you're building a true partnership. Mm -hmm. So the guy's not just an advertiser and you're not just uh, an affiliate. You're really building that long-term partnership. And some of our, the most successful relationships we've seen are these sort of mm -hmm. combo partnerships where right. both parties are interested in working together, you optimize each other's funnels, whatever. It's a very good way to do these things.